Welcome back to another part of Parasite Eve. If you guys do enjoy, make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and let's get into it. Today is day six, liberta uh, libertation. Will you save? Sure. I mean, rather save, right? It's a weird cutscene. <laughs> Ayo, come on. Ayo, what's wrong? Ah, you were great. Uh, shows that my only partner can pull it off, huh? Yes, I uh, relieved that you made it uh, back safely. What the hell did Eve uh, have to do? Or have to bring all this uh, to the Statue of Liberty. Because the ocean, that's what symbolizes it. Uh, the ocean is the mother of all creation. Uh, this is where this is where she wanted uh, to give you to give birth. If you, if you don't mind, I'd like to have some time to myself. Everyone else has been guided inside, miss. I guess I have to go inside also. It's weird that I can move here. That's a door right there also. Let me just check here. Can't enter there. Let's go in here. Goodness. You could have opened the door for me, you son of a bitch. Just standing there. No need for this anymore. You can take it. Uh, keep it as a souvenir, huh? Y yes, thank you. Uh, Aya, Wayne came all the way from the precinct to see you. Yo, Aya. Oh, I'll be outside. The smell of oil makes me, uh, rather queasy. I knew it. I knew you would, uh, do it. When I heard that you blew that, uh, thing to bits, I had to come over here. Everyone's saying that you're the number one cop in New York right now. Hey, what's wrong? You killed that thing. Aren't you happy? I guess you're in shock uh, or something, huh? Yeah. Uh, you're probably tired too. I'll take things... Uh, that you... Uh, I'll, I'll take the things that... That are in your way. So rest up now, do you hear? I, I don't want to put stuff away. I actually want to... I mean... Right? We don't need any of these things, I think. Now my inventory is going to be better. But there is a problem. We have no more heals left, it seems. Hey, that's a souvenir uh, for blown Eve away. I'll engrave your name on your weapon. Choose the weapon and armor. I don't know why I would do this, though. Just move, okay. I just ended.
<laughs> it's great being uh, on this cruiser. Gotta tell my mom about this. And we can save there. Officer, well done. I have received some supplies from Admiral Willis. Uh, please make use of whatever items you need. Thank you. Sorry, but I don't have any more. Okay, we should have a lot of medicine now. Nice. The problem still is that I'm I'm I need it, It's weird that I they that, that that they don't give it for me, dude. Like I need one more thing, and that, that is like what is it called, dude? A tool. I need it I need like one or two tools to be strong. And it looks like I'm not getting any. Or at least I don't know where to get any. Some Christmas, huh? Tell me about it. I can't move. Sorry we're late. Uh, we could not approach the creature without the absolute confirmation of, the, of its death. Uh, your help was greatly appreciated. Please rest inside. As citizens... Never mind. What, what, what's going on? We what? What is it? You're scaring me. That huge creature that the Metrotrodia was creating was... It couldn't have been the uterus or the ultimate being, no. That's one devil baby, dude. What the heck? What the hell is that? You got... You got to be kidding. That is the ultimate being. We didn't make it in time. What are these explosions? The Mercutrodia energy must be out of control. To the point where it is... Uh, con uh, it, where it's causing the explosions. We will escape a helicopter. Please follow me. This we all can do for now is run. Hey, uh, come on. Hey, uh, what's wrong? I have to take care of this. Hey, uh, no. Don't worry about me. I'll be back. Please hurry. Shut up, man. Hey, uh, please take this. Man, I press X. It's not voodoo stuff. Hurry, please. You two should go. Yeah, you're coming back no matter what you hear. What? Dude, I want to get what he's, say what he's giving me. Why can't I take what he's giving me? Oh, hello. Hello, baby. <clears throat> it's you or me. Who's gonna Who's gonna be the one to make it through? 
That's the question. Here we go. Should I just do my ability? Liberate. What the? You can't be dead yet, bro. There's no way. There you go. This is growing. What's happening? Yo. Look at these bullets. Yo, dude. There's two targets, it seems. And I'm I'm playing with a regular pistol. Yo, just turn into two targets. Oh my goodness, please. Can I use that ability again? Liberate, yes. How strong is this, dude? Hey, one part is dead. No. Wow, I ran the wrong way. Eight though. Oh my goodness. What just happened? This. This is the mature being. My goodness. You're hurt. You're hurt, dude. What was that? His tail... His tail has a bull sack. <laughs> Whoa!
왔다. It's still growing? No. It's still evolving. My goodness, dude. We're doing what damage to him? There's no other targets. I don't know if we should, though. Okay, I thought so. I'm gonna load. It's not gonna work. I'm gonna use something else. Uh, we're gonna use... Uh, I will use haste. I know you want to continue living. After all, you were just born. But I want to live too, like all the other human beings. Damn, there's no end to this. If only we could get this to Maya. What are those? It's bullets with AR's cells in them. So that's what you try we're trying to give her? But think it's too late now. There's nothing we can do. Stupid, give him to me. He's a mad lad, dude. Daniel. This is from Maida. Mere, 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 Mere. Whoa, that damage. At least he's laughing, right? <laughs> what the green screen was that, dude? What? He's still alive. Oh my god. Uh, there's gotta be something on this cruiser to get rid of this. Okay. The engine room. Left or right, dude. I'll save. Oh, 
I almost ran the wrong way. How much faster is this music gonna go, dude? Uh, if the boiler pressure shoots up, I can blow the ship to bits. Do you know where we are? We're in Hal's Kitchen. I can't make it in time from here. Are we dead now? Yep. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. So I'll just load. Unfortunately, it's a little bit back. Because I say it like, whether it's left or right, I'll save. Looks like we were at the right location. I should have saved when I knew uh, this is the right place. This makes me think of Resident Evil as well, this part. At least Resident Evil 3, right? Okay. Now we'll save here. Oh snap, it's still following me. How is this weird fish the ultimate being? Goodness, dude. It's finally over. I don't understand. Why do I have this power? 
It's because Maya is inside of you too. Eh? What? When your mother and your sister died, and they transplanted a part of your sister into you. Into me? Yeah? Uh, when you were seven, you probably don't remember any of it, but... Uh, you were born with a different... Uh, with a defect in your right eye. And so Maya's cornea was transplanted into your right eye. My right eye. Then I saw when I touched Eve's eye, Eve, Eve's was, what? Then what I saw when I touched Eve was Medea. It said that when you, uh, when you have an extreme uh, experience, what you see is branded onto the cornea. Uh, but this hasn't been significantly proven. That was Maya's last memory. That was the last thing she ever saw. As for the Metrotoria, that was in Aya's body. I think I think it underwent a different evolution, evolutionary change than, uh, than Eve. By living symbolically with Aya's Metrotoria, it still possesses Eve's power from there. It evolved to the point where it could live symbolically with the human nucleus. Me and Maya are a Metrotoria power. Starting with the uh, incident in Japan and now with this, I wonder if this is a message to all mankind. Message? What kind of message? How can I explain? If the Earth is a single human being, we humans that invade the Earth become like v viruses out of control. We, in essence, are upsetting the na natural balance of the body. This is de uh, definitely utter destruction. No, we're, we're, we're not that, that weak, yes. You see, humans are, in essence, parasites. You can say that we are parasites and the world is our, uh, our host. Look, the sun is coming up. I saw no sun there. Okay, never mind. Well, 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 I guess this is the end. Come on, Aya. Here, take my hand. Thank you, Ben. I'm too good with these social events. Nah, not me. I love these things. Uh, we have to make up for Christmas Eve. This is my first time, so mm, I'm nervous. Uh, that's because you with Aya and all dressed up. What? No, 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 that's not it. It's starting, shall we? That is true, though. I would also be stressing sitting next to Aya's sexy booty while she's dressed up.
Hmm, yes. Daniel and Ben are late. It better hurry, it's going to start soon. I'm not pressing, by the way. It, it, I just can't read that fast. Uh, the restroom must be really crowded. Yes, that's probably it. What's wrong? You seem tense. Uh, yes, of course. What? Uh, oh, well. Dude, look at that. Movement AI, yeah, all right, made it on time. I'm, I'm sitting next to you. Uh, sorry, we're late. That uh, Japanese guy is not happy. Father, please give me permission to marry Ava. I forbid it. You know well what happened if you do. Those who come, the beauty of all, die a horrible ways. You don't understand. As she is the one that suffered after death. He is evil. Grab, guard grab her and burn her at the stake. Father, if you are sentencing her to death, uh, then I ask to take my life also, I guess. Edward. Go back, would... what? Sorry. Get with it, guys. It's game over, man. It's game over. Hey, throw sexy. What the damn hell? That is, that is creepy, dude. And there we go.
Okay, time for honesty and a review, right? So, first of all, one thing I gotta be honest about is that the team worked that worked on this game is way, way, way bigger than I thought. Way bigger. Uh, sure, we can save. We finish the game now. So, I don't know what X means. Maybe uh, you, you can do it again. So yeah, the, 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 the team behind this game is way bigger than I thought. Way bigger. I thought it maybe like... I mean, if you compare the game, if it was made today, there would be like literally five, maybe six people working on a game like this. And it would still take them a full year to make. Um, this game is huge, okay? If you compare it to like Resident Evil 1, um, this game like has so many more, so many more places that you could go. Uh, so if you think it's easily to get lost in a game like Resident Evil 1 or 2, no, this game is 10 times worse. Like if you don't know where to go, you can get lost so easily. So, so, so easily, dude. There's so many places to go, so many things to do. And the cool thing about this game is, if you are in the wrong location, at least you're getting stronger. But now, I can argue uh, about that as well. Um, the chest I had, I upgraded once. And the weapon I had, I couldn't upgrade because all my upgrades was in a different gun. So you could play this game from beginning to end without leveling. Or I would say without upgrading your weapons. You could still finish this game easily. It's just you might have some ammo issues like I had. I had to restart a, a, like a certain location four or five times because I kept running out of ammo against the same boss. So I changed to a stronger gun and it was all sorted, right? So I would say the big thing to take away is um, the gun is more important than upgrading it. Okay, so the upgrade mechanism of this game, you don't really need to partake in it at all. You could just speed run this game if you know where to go, and you should have no mana issues, or sorry, no, no ammo issues whatsoever. Other than that fact that there is some, mana, uh, some ammo issues, uh, the other big thing that I had a, a big problem with is inventory management. Um, now, coming from someone that plays a lot of Resident Evil, uh, inventory management is not a big deal in so many games. If you know where to go, for example in Resident Evil, if you know where to go and what's coming up next, you know what to carry with you. However, in this game, I feel like you don't have to carry anything. You just have to ca carry some healing, some ammo, and that's it. And, and a gun, one gun with, with one armor. You don't need anything else. All the cures and all the junk parts, all of that you could just throw away. You don't, you don't need that. Uh, so, again, in my opinion, um, no other item was needed in this game other than medication, ammo, a weapon, and a chest piece, and an armor piece, right? So it's literally four, four things only. But you get so many different cures and so many um, full heals and revives and like there's so many different items that that was just a waste. I, I think it was just a waste. It, it's not necessary, right? Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. If I have to rate this game, I would give it a 7 out of 10, okay? I would rate this game higher. If there was voice acting involved, I mean, this game has two discs. If you compare it to a game like Metal Gear Solid, um, there's almost, like, you don't have to read anything. Everything is read for you. Uh, there's voice actors and stuff like that. But in this game, I had to physically read everything because if I don't read it, no one's going to read it for me, right? So, uh... I would give this game a 9 out of 10 if there was voice acting involved, but without the voice acting, I have to give it a 7, okay? The game is really fun to play. If you don't play it for the story itself, if you just want to play the game, um, yeah, this game is really fun to play. I would, I would highly recommend playing it, 
even even 20 years later where we are right now it's still very fun to play so hopefully my review made sense for you guys i think a 7 out of 10 is really good for this game like i said a 9 out of 10 would have been there if there was voice acting involved um which i give uh resident evil 2 uh, resident evil 2 as well uh, the original and also resident evil 3 uh, resident evil 1 i don't really didn't really give reviews and stuff like that but resident evil 1 i would give a 6 out of 10 the voice acting there was so bad that they they could have just done what parasite eve do and give you text uh not even joking about that um uh yeah so but that's pretty much my conclusion hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did remember to leave a like subscribe if you're new there's going to be so many more videos to come in the future and i i hope to see you guys uh, take part in those as well but from the bottom of my heart thank you so much for being here thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next series thanks for watching guys take care bye bye <laughs>